Oh, actually, I can discuss it now with you, chat, about the premium pass. Like, I'll scatter images in the video, but to cover what's... I can quickly cover it. Now. Anyway, as I was saying, so the battle pass will kind of work similar to this. So you know where you can buy it or add fu like sorry you can i need to add funds to prove my point you can either activate it on your account or you can buy it as an item and then sell it oh, the really? battle the battle pass will work in the same way it will work the same way like this you can buy the premium battle pass and list it up here now the pricing is i believe 600 rubles which is like ten dollars Roughly. So it's about $10 for the premium battle pass. And the other information that seems to be somewhat accurate is everything from it is tradable. So the way it works is you get like uh, tokens from the battle pass, which you can then use to uh, obtain skins and other items and stuff. I don't know the exact rewards though. That but, sounds pretty good, nice, because yeah. you can probably make a lot of money with that. It means that if you can't afford the the premium uh, like track on the battle pass, you can farm up money and get it in-game with in-game money. So that's somewhat balanced, chat. Like, the pricing is not bad at all. Like, you can run around and farm and get two... Like, you can get two mil fairly easy if you put the effort in. So, like... I wouldn't be worried about, oh, I don't have real life money to buy the premium track. Because if you put the time in, you'll just be able to outright buy it. So, I reckon the, the for, if we're going off uh, NA prices, it will probably cost you about 2 mil. On EU, maybe a little bit more. Because it will be about 10, $10. So, I'd imagine it's 1.5 mil to 2 mil. No. Uh... The, the rewards from the battle pass, I don't know what is in it. Um, from the images I've seen and people that have like have access to it, it's literally got Minecraft rocks as the reward. So that's a nice little reminder that the game did originate from a uh, you know a Minecraft mod. But so we don't know what rewards are in it. But that's how the battle pass will work, chat. You'll have a free track where you'll earn stuff and a premium chat uh, track where you'll earn stuff. It, it's literally the same as every other battle pass in every game. We know how battle passes work. I feel like the highlight of it is is just that you can trade it. Like, you can buy it with in-game money. So. That's the good thing. Uh, I have uploaded a video on the event, which I'm going to link in the the video of this conversation as well. Uh, I have uploaded the new footage, but it, it works the same way as the original, uh, like, footage we went over where, you know, you have to survive a snowstorm and when you die, you turn into a zombie and then you have to, like, break the generator and stuff. If you're a human, you've got to defend the generator. It looks like a fun little game mode and the battle pass should just keep people active, especially players that are, like, in endgame. And have nothing to really do. So yeah, that's all the information that I have on the battle. I don't think I've missed anything. And I'll have images and stuff to show on that when I actually put this video together.